Whoa. Oh shit, I forgot he hasn't used his quirk at all yet. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Let's React. I'm Kenny and this is my wife Montana. And today we're going to be reacting to Season 2, Episode 5 of My Hero Academia, Cavalry Battle Finale. I'm very excited about 1B, but I'm also just excited to kind of see everyone continuing to work together. I'm excited for you to see even more and no pun intended, you've only seen the tip of the iceberg. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below if you're excited for more My Hero Academia coming every Sunday at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you can't wait and want to see these episodes early, they're all posted to Patreon right now in their extended full-length forms. Are we excited for episode five of season two of My Hero? Absolutely. All right, let's get it. Let's go. Underheads, this video was brought to you by the incredible members of the Let's React Patreon. If you want access to a ton of exclusive perks, check out the link in the description below. Have a good day, Twinkle Toes. I love that last one. Farewell and put up your peace sign. Keep rolling uh, the never ending story. Like, yeah. It's just, I don't know. I, I always read that. I'm like, that's my hero. You know, Kirishima does give me Appa vibes right there. Yeah. The hair, too. Mm-hmm. Bakugo and Todoroki have challenged you already, but they aren't the only ones who see you as a rival. I'll try my best to defeat you. You ready? Yeah! Hatsune? <laughs> Tokoyami? Yes. Let's yes. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> Let's see how Kai does. Calling Sue the wrong name counter goes. Also, that was so smart of Bakugo to go and then get the tape to pull him back. Oh, yeah. Because you're technically still all in one piece. Yeah. I'll be taking that now. <laughs> all right, here the we go. He's just panicked every single time uh deku is yeah yeah so funny normally i wouldn't have teamed up with you but this was a good plan or i'm not sure how you lost your headband where the heck did it go it stole oh it. no nothing left to lose shoji full on attack mode we'll use all our powers to steal a point from those two teams i didn't think this confrontation would happen until wait later. are they just a group of three Sue and the sticky. I suppose kid. so. All right. I didn't think this confrontation would happen until later. In the I never put that together. It's four people, but just in terms of arms. <laughs> yeah. The game's only halfway over. We can't stop now. I guess you're at a disadvantage. You get less points and quirks if you don't have four. Yeah. Oh. Look at the planning. Oh whoa. Sorry, he used to get ready to what us. Oh my god. Pretty effective. Wow. Yeah. So that's not just going to take him out. It's that's everyone. Well, yeah. All right. Ice man <laughs> and ice them. Mm. Of course, he was surprised by how many people avoided his attack. He's adapting his strategy. Nice. He thought about it. Smart improvement. Nice. I might as well take these. Oh. oh. The jetpack's malfunctioning. <laughs> oh, God. 
Her creation quirk is so cool. That's a little bit broken. Your creation quirk, we have to be yeah. careful. No, Kaminari is the one to fear. If there was any more sunlight, Kaminari's attack would have completely destroyed Dark Shadow. How? So, what I want you to do is devote yourself to defense. I'm hoping you won't You'll have see. to attack at all. Sound good? Hmm. Interesting. Uh, Are we gonna use the tunnels? My ability gets stronger when I'm in darkness. Okay. But that makes Dark Shadow aggressive and difficult to control. Oh. On the other hand, the beast is easy to handle in the sunlight. That's at the cost of its attack power, though. You couldn't have known this, and yet you've chosen the correct role for me. Your proposal seems like a good one under the circumstances. So his quirk has limitations. Very well. Most quirks do. Interesting. So that it's electricity. A, limit a limitation or a specification. Because if it's stronger and weaker in certain ways, that's not... I guess, well, if you look at it that way, that's that's one way to look at it. But what I would see is if I had a strengths category, I'd put like at night. And if I looked at weaknesses, it would say daytime sunlight. Okay, but in a situation where you need extreme control, like a laser maze situation, doing that at nighttime with an unruly, powerful beast versus something small and well-behaved, that's better in a different situation. It, it is, but either way, it is a limitation because you're either A, limited because you have too much sunlight, or B, you have to use sunlight because you are limited with your control over the beast. So okay. that's a, there is a limit. Okay. You know? the, I would say the limit amount is nearly constant, but it's a matter of which direction it goes between control and power. Okay, that's a good point. Yeah, mm. but that was really good. But that's a good distinction you made. Thank you. Yeah, making me think about the show more too. <laughs> that's what I love to do. His lightning is our big problem. As long as he keeps using his quirk, it will be very difficult for me to attack. Dark Shadow is too timid in the light. Violet solves nothing. <laughs> it's Montana I fire. I love him. That's, yes. I'm not a fighter. I'm Nowhere left to run. To be a fighter. They have no idea that's the case, right? <laughs> I don't think so. The only person I've mentioned this weakness to is Coda back at the USJ. He's a man of very few words. Okay, good deal. We can use that. This will work out. All we have to do is hang on to the 10 million points, no matter what. Your class is too small-minded. Think bigger. What did you say? The way he just casually took it. Yeah, that was disrespectful. Kind of famous. You'll have to tell me about it sometime. It must be strange to always find yourself in the role of the victim. Uh, like, Kirishima. <laughs> he's we upset. Have a change of plan. <laughs> Monoma, don't provoke him, man. That's the kind of thing he would do. <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. It's not very heroic of me. Besides, you know how these things work. Heroes are always being hounded by moronic villains desperate for some kind of revenge. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Calm down, Bakugo. You've got to keep a level head or we'll never get our points back. Yeah, good luck. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been calmer. Can't you tell? <laughs> now get after them, <laughs> That's a Please calm dude. <laughs> Just... <laughs> Oh, dodged him. Oh, wow. Ha I see why you like this quirk. What just happened? Oh, weird. Is, is his, like, re rebound? Look. Just keep watching. I don't want to spoil it. You both have impressive powers, but I think you'll agree mine's better. He, he hardened. His quirk. Oh my god. Can copy other powers. That's sick. Nato Monoma. His quirk? Copy. Love he that. Use the of whomever he touches, but only for five minutes. Plus, he okay. can only borrow one at a time. So okay. even an idiot. Pretty cool, right? It but it has to be touch based first. <sighs> Gotta get a touch okay. and then he gets okay, it for and five then minutes. Yeah. Nice one. Thanks for the backup, Bonto. Monoma. If we keep those headbands for good, as long as no one gets near us, we'll make our class proud. Stop him! It's too sticky! 
Stop! I can't move! That quirk is just so interesting. Yeah. Hurry! We're sitting at zero points now! Oh, no hard feelings, that right? Sucks. After <laughs> all, you provoked us. What was it you said in your little speech before the games? Uh, oh, right. I just want to say I'm going to win. Oh my god. <laughs> this isn't over. I'm still going to come Yeah, that's top. why you don't look need at that. Look at the pupil size. I'll be the undeniable champion. Only one minute left. Tony Loki has cornered the 10 million point team that is poised to seize the ultimate prize. Wow. Prize. It's all come down to this. Okay. All Might thinks he's doing a good job. That's so nice. Yeah. And then, uh, so just quick note, what do you think of the quirk copy? Like, and what just that's happened? That's so cool. I think, okay, that's awesome. The first thing I thought of is like the skill aspect of like how much practicing with a quirk helps. I mean, maybe that's like part of his quirk that he can like get to a certain skill level. At like, its core, it is copying just the quirk. Okay. So... For instance, if there was a quirk that required a lot of practice, like Yayurozu's, if he were to touch her and get her power, but he didn't know any of the formulas for anything, he wouldn't really be able to do anything, right? It's an interesting point. Okay, that was super clarifying. Thank you for that. He's exploiting your weaknesses. Don't be a fool. Shut the fuck up. Staying on my left side. That's a strategy. Ah, very position, nice. If I try to freeze them, I'll hit Ida. Oh, okay. Like all right, all right. No way I can get a clear shot at his team. I know it. Plus, Tokoyami can defend against Kaminari's electricity. There's not much time left. The bastard. <laughs> Everyone, we have less than 60 seconds. I'm going to do something that'll make me useless to you. But it's worth it. What do you Great. Do? Make sure I you love get this. that headband. Brace yourselves. Hold on tight. Torch over. Oh. Oh my God. Reciprocal burst. That's a okay. Move. Sick. So we got it, but they're not going to be able to move after this. Mm hmm. That's like Ida's special move. Okay. But he's maxed out now, and they yep. still have like 40 seconds. Yep. But now they're on defense. Yes. Which gives me explosive power. Unfortunately, the recoil stalls my engines for a while. It's a secret move I've been saving. No one in the class knew about it. I think that's so cool. <laughs> that is cool. That's the first time I've seen Deku look like... I do my best to beat you. He didn't tell him about the movie. No. This entire game was just turned completely on its head. Todoroki's team has the 10 million points, and Minori's team is suddenly left with nothing at all. Don't let that go. Minori's still a problem for us. It'll be smarter for us to try for other points now. We can't. I think it's one of my Not favorite named moves in the show. Mm -hmm. Gotta go for it. Yep. <laughs> That's her flashback. <laughs> I'm gonna use it to my advantage. Whoa. Oh shit, I forgot he hasn't used his quirk at all yet. That's sick. And he used fire. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, yeah. wait, 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 go back, go back, go back. Yeah. What the fuck? I didn't want to point it out, but... No! Oh! We all have our reasons to win this, and I refuse to let the others down! Oh my god! Why? I don't want to pause it, because let's just stay okay, in the moment. Okay, but okay, Think about why did, oh he, my god. why did he use it? Pretty crazy. That... Despite their best efforts, Team Midoriya has fallen to the bottom. 
and that's game over, right? The time. Well, or is there... this is prior to that. Okay. We've done pretty well for ourselves. Now we this is a flashback, or okay. technically, just something else that was happening. Okay. Oh shit! <laughs> Wow. Okay. So like a force field. Go. Wow. Oni got a lot too. Yep. And he got the tape to get him back. Very smart. Fantastic. Uh, I forget some of these little moments. Is yeah. A difference between those unexpected. Who for the top and those who will settle, and that difference matters. Glad he won't settle until he's interesting. Okay. He got it. Wow. That's awesome. So. I do want to ask, what do you think of wow. Bakugo in that moment? Uh, wow, that was so cool. The t he was leading. Yeah, he was, wow. Interesting because I feel like there's a specific kind of leader who can lead successfully by yelling at people. And it's when they're decided to be the leader by default from their teammates. He was a dick about it, but it worked. <laughs> Yeah. He was like, acid girl. And he, was and he like, wasn't a dick about it from the very, very beginning. Like, it was only once they, like, really got to a place where he was the best suited to take control of that. Sick moment. Now, we're going after Deku and Taro. What's going on here? It was the first time I used so my he's going to think. This will be fine. I'm not actually going to hit him. I'm just slicing <laughs> through the air. To take out my opponent's defenses. What? Moved his arm in the flame. And my took off the fire? What am I doing? My hand hurts, but it's not broken. He's turned the bands around to hide their point values. I put the 10 million one on last, right? So it must be on top. I got it! So we got one. Oh my god. Okay, why wouldn't you just take all of them? He, he okay, made okay. a window with that. Oh room my goodness. And had to choose one. Okay, did he pick the right one though? Please tell me I got something wrong with my eyes. And mixed the headbands up. There's no way we'd leave the prize on top. You underestimate us. But Shoto didn't even realize he was using his Wow. Left side. He didn't even know. Yeah. No. No. <laughs> oh wait, but he's gonna think Deku has the million. <laughs> yeah. Or he just doesn't even know. <laughs> no. He's just sending it. <laughs> I see hot. 
That's funny. <laughs> so, yeah, that's where okay. we're left. Are you okay, man? <laughs> no. That's a no. Now, let's take a look at who our top four teams are. In first place, King Todoroki. We ended in first place, but it was too close for comfort. Uh, I'm sorry. I let everyone down, didn't I? That's not true. You're the reason we won. Yeah, literally. Yeah. Move of yours. In second place, Team Bakugo. Uh, we were so close to first place. Yeah, he just didn't sure. want to settle. No. So it's all good. Yeah. yeah. An important quote from All Might earlier: "Those who settle and those who go for the top." Mm -hmm. Is good isn't it good enough? Oh. How did that happen? Hmm. Hey, Deku. Guys, I'm really sorry. But yeah, his team came out of nowhere no. in third. Yeah. I must apologize when Todoroki was shaken by your first attack. I tried to grab the 10 million point headband, but things and I didn't did. go as planned. No? Still, I got one. It was around his head where his guard was the weakest. Yay! Lord, you're the one who created the opening. The way Dark Shadow's holding it. <laughs> Very cute. And in fourth place is oh, thank God. Okay. <laughs> That's one of my favorite crimes. <laughs> That's funny. I said I'd never use this to attack. But as soon as I was overwhelmed, I broke my own promise. At this was that attacking or defense? Win, he was trying to attack. Exactly yeah. So, okay, Few, so a lot just happened. What are your first thoughts? Wow, I'm very happy that Deku's group made it through because that was gonna suck. Yeah. I mean, that just eliminated quite a few people. It eliminated a ton of people. Yeah, but his hand was okay. Yeah, he made it through as his second successful one for all usage. Okay, when he was about to use it, he kept, it was like he was talking himself Oh, I'm not using it to attack. I'm just like moving my hand forward. Maybe the knowledge that he's like actively trying to hurt someone is the reason that his hand keeps having difficulty and when he's using it in like a defense shield type situation mm -hmm. that it's okay. Yeah, um, it's good guesses. Um, but we'll have to see in the next round. Mm -hmm. But uh, also Todoroki accidentally using his left side, not even realizing Yeah, it. That, that was very, very interesting because it was so subconscious. I mean, I think he's beating himself up because he's like, I said I would never do this, but it's not like he made the choice to do it. It was just a response. So I, I, don't, I don't feel like that's him like going back on that statement the way he thinks it is mm. i think in the next few episodes we'll see what you think moving forward but that that's a great line of thinking so we have our 16. all right Is it a shadow oh, thing? How disappointing. Mina, congrats. Um, thanks, but Bakugo only asked me to join because I could melt Todoroki's ice. It's not like, you know, I really helped that much. Ida, you are holding out on us. Literally. I had no idea you could do that. Rest assured, it wasn't my intention to deceive you. I was just being strategic. <laughs> <laughs> and deceiving you was really strategic. <laughs> yeah. With Midoriya. You're always trying to one-up each other. Oh, speaking of which, where'd he go? Has anyone seen Deku? I don't know where he could be. Oh. <laughs> you brought me here. Now what? Yo, 
Oh. Long time no see. Let's catch up. Endeavor. All might. How is he such a dick if he's like a hero? Like, I feel like the way they're showing him is like he's a villain, but he's like literally the number two behind All Might. Which, yep. like, not that people can't be like publicly good and privately just the fucking worst. The power coming from you felt the same as All Might's. <laughs> Midoriya, tell me. Are you really All Might's secret love child or something? <laughs> Am I? What? <laughs> but that is about it for this episode. Uh, what are your thoughts before we jump into our discussion? Great episode. I'm super excited to see why that all for one, one for all. Do you mean one, one for, all? for all? Fuck. Why do I keep doing that? Yeah, you just keep you keep doing it. <clears throat> it's funny. It's because of the song from A League of Their Own. Mm. Oh, it's a saying, just generally. Yeah, but that's why my brain keeps going there, because that's like, yeah. the order that they... One for all. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm super excited to see why that specific use of one for all didn't wreck his hand. Because before, I feel like he was limiting the power he put in and it was still damaging. But for that one, it seemed like the like flamey stuff went all the way up his arm and yet it was still fine. Very interesting. A lot of interesting stuff to discuss. Yes. Um, and uh, there's even more than that to get into. Yeah. A lot of character moments this episode. Mm -hmm. But uh, if you enjoyed that and are excited for our next episode, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below and be on the lookout for episode six of season two coming this Friday at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If you can't wait and want to see these episodes of My Hero early in their extended full-length forms, they're all posted to Patreon right now. We have a lot to discuss. Before we do that, where are we headed? All right, let's review. Thank you for watching. For now, we're going to go to questions given to us by our amazing Patreon members. If you want to ask us questions after every episode that we watch of any show we're watching, uh, check out the link in the description below and join at any level to start asking. For now, let's go to question one. I actually have all the questions already prepared. Great. Because I've seen this show. Fantastic. Um, Brendan O'Connor asks, who do you think was the MVP in Deku, Todoroki, and Bakugo's teams? Which individual was the most useful and important? Okay, for Bakugo's team, I think it's probably got to be Bakugo just because of the way that he coordinated everything at the end. Like, I don't want to take credit from everyone, from anyone, because it's obviously like a team effort. But the way that that kind of like countdown competition goes, it's kind of whoever is like the most clutch in the last, like, down to the wire moments. Yeah, um, but I'd argue somebody else besides Bakugo and his group was more clutch in those moments. If I had to say somebody, I'd say it'd be the guy with the tape quirk, because otherwise Bakugo can't keep jumping off. I think that, that was Bakugo's whole strategy. That, yeah. Like, it, it's a little bit of both, but, like, that it's tape move tough. was used, like, five times. Like, I feel like that's a pretty, like, that was their, if I had to choose the MVP, I would say it was their ability to reach out and get to other groups. Interesting. Okay. Yeah. Uh, but yeah. Um, what about Todoroki's group? We had Todoroki, um... Uh, Kaminari, who had the um, uh, had the electricity quirk. Mm -hmm. um, Yairozu had creation, and then uh, Ida with the jet legs. In terms of the last minute save, probably Ida, especially yeah. because I can't imagine keeping something like that secret was very easy, especially given how competitive he is and how hard he's trying to stand out and how much he has not succeeded in doing that up until this point. Yeah. Like the idea. It was his moment. Yeah. yeah the, but saving that, that requires a lot of self-control. Mm -hmm. um, especially when your like, classmates are doing such huge, amazing things. Like, exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Like I just. I agree. I think he's definitely the MVP. Of that yeah. Group. Yeah, and then what about Deku's group? We have Deku, Dark Shadow, Ochako, and uh, the support group person. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, I don't know all the names. Yeah. If somebody know, I'm sure most people know, not most, I'm sure a lot of people know all the My Hero names. There are just so many characters. Mm -hmm. so. In terms of the like clutch aspect, I think it's got to be Dark Shadow mm. with the save at the end, but also the like the defense all the time. And yeah, the, the like surround monitoring, omnidirectional. That was yeah. so so important. I agree. I think he was definitely at the top of their group. Yeah, yeah. 
All right, let's go to our third question. Sorry, second question. Jacob O'Neill asks, what do you think of All Might's line? There's a difference between those who aim for the top and those who settle in reference to Bakugo. Yeah, I definitely think that's one of those characteristics where objectively people are gonna be more successful if they have that trait, but I think they're also gonna objectively be more unhappy. Yeah. Because the frustrating thing about wanting to be the best is only one person ever can be. And there are so many people. And I mean, this is just kind of true in general, but even more so in a universe where everyone's powers are different. There's there's no way for something to be undisputed because it's the entire thing is apples and oranges. All right, last question. Just Your Average Fangirl asks, what do you think Shoto wants with Midoriya? Also, what do you think about the parallel between the two boys compared to their father and father figures, All Might and Endeavor? My guess is he wants to know how Deku like brought the fire out um, because that's so unprecedented for him. And the only difference was that it was like Deku really attacking him. So maybe he thinks that Deku's quirk is some kind of like quirk shifter, like a version of the copy quirk but where it like inverses your quirk or something. I don't know. Um, so you think he's just looking at, looking for how he did, like how he got that to happen? Yes, I think he's looking for an explanation as to why that happened. Interesting guess. And then what do you think of the comparison between like Todoroki to Endeavor and then All Might to Deku? It's a very cool comparison, especially considering that All Might is a better hero. And a more chipper guy, like he's just exactly. He's just like genuinely a happier person, exactly. And the really interesting thing about it is, I think if Endeavor were number one and All Might were number two, Endeavor would still be miserable and All Might would still be happy. I don't. I agree that All Might would still be happy. I don't think Endeavor would be miserable. Well, he. I think he would find something. You know, actually, he would have some reasons to be miserable that I cannot disclose. But um. But there would be something because he's just that kind of person. You're reading him for filth, and I love it. Um, you're just what can I say? dragging his ass. Shitty um, dads. You haven't even heard anything yet. Wheelhouse. Okay. <laughs> uh, I think that's a great point to leave this episode, especially going into next episode. The boy born with everything. Um, Except a good dad. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> I don't even know who that's about, but Oop. I can guess. Oop. That's about it for episode five of season two of My Hero. Are we excited for episode six? Can't wait. All right. Let's get it. Let's go. Let's go.